you want to make sure that it's glued properly the glam life lace tin that you use is dry after spraying it if not you're gonna get yourself in some serious trouble of it lifting so like I said add more if you have to you want to lay this one first and then go in with the other one so you know where to place the other one so yeah making sure the back and the sides of that one is laid properly to put some more glue put it and dry So I'll take my scissors and apply that. It's so much easier to go under there and apply rather than to put more. And when you have to clean up, it's rough and tough to clean it up. So what I'm doing now, I'm going in with my glue on the side of the list that the glue become dry in the back part I'm going to put some glue pull it make sure it's dry it's laying flat pull it down and dry if you have to so can you guys see look this side here I will chip it out a little. We'll add some glue because the little piece is raising up there. But I'm going to go back in with the scissors and make sure I cut a piece of the lace that I'm seeing on this part here to keep my part clean. You see that? But what I did on this side, because this is the outer side, I just cut a little piece of this lace here. This edge of the lace that we usually sew down. To the weave I cut a piece of that so that I can have that smooth look see and I'll fix it I'll go in and I'll comb it up and fix it to have that scalp like look I'll show you guys how I do all I I pull it tight I pull it because you want to pull it you know what's coming out there is from what I cut metal tip comb and part it front here is drying a little more but I'm going to part in the meanwhile to make sure there's no umps and bumps see that that's what you want no humps no bumps Gel got up there. See? No arms, no bumps. See? And I usually don't apply when I'm doing it for myself. I don't go ahead and do all I do for my client. adding foundation and so on I'm not going to add foundation I'm going to wait and just when I part it then I'll put my foundation see that that's raising up this piece there I'm going to add some more glue First, I'm gonna check and see if it's if I need that piece or I need to cut it out. 
create friction with this comb and just cut out this little piece here then add a little more lace glue I'm going to dry that so it doesn't cut the lace and leave it looking white. So this side of lace is already dry so I can add another, another layer. Not too much is that thin layer going to do me right. But the other lace glue, I use that a lot. <laughs> By no means at all, when you're using this glue or any other lace glue, by no means, don't touch it. Just let your little rock tail comb or your, the teeth of your comb do the work. The little right spot got to get clear and then I'm going to add the other lace. Yeah, a little white spot there and a little white spot there. So this is the other one. I have it a little slack, so if I need to pull it out, I could. I've already spurred, spurred my glam light, the stint, the chestnut. And it's pretty much dry. I'm going to go ahead and apply this. I'm going to lose it. I can pull it and make sure it's stretched all the way out. I can pull the back now if I want it because the front is laid. I'm going to dry this little spot here because remember you want it as dry as possible. You don't want that white residue. And I have some that the lace that has no glue. Let it to the front. I'm going to see if I need it if I, or if I don't. If I need it, I'm just going to add a little more glue there. If I don't, I'm just going to cut it out. Spread out that thin layer. While that's drying, I have my track. I'm going to measure it and cut it because I know where this stuff already. Feel for the other one. I mark it right there. And I know I need up to here. This much. I'm going to cut two rows like this. Put the glue, let it dry while I'm going to fix the front of that lace. So that way I just have to put it on when I'm done. <laughs> See? I'm going to tie the edges now so that can stay there and melt in nice and then um, finish the rest of the head laying these tracks. The products used will be listed in the description box. Just look below and I'll be right back with a finished product. So hi guys and dolls. This end up being a wet look instead of a curl. I couldn't even flat iron it out or anything. Yes, guys, like, love, share. You want a full look of this hairdo? There we go. Yes. This is my birthday look. I didn't do any cut crease or so on, just a regular shadow quick look. 
So like, love, and share this video, guys. I'll share and with this water and leave-in conditioner, I'm just gonna make it a wet look because ain't nothing getting curlers straightened today. Ain't nothing happening like that. Cut my hair. Yes, I did that. I needed a change, you know. So there's the cut. Yes. So this is my look. I can wear it any any ways I want to. I can bring it in front whenever I want to. When it I can bring it to the front, still have the cut. Wear it like this. Or I can wear it the way I had it. Or that's the next reason why I use a uh, um a lace closure uh two four by four closure or why i use a closure in front a lace closure is because i want that option whenever i'm going to work i don't go to work looking this saucy and crazy i'm going to work i'm going to part the middle of it of the lace and i'm going to bring it over this side so it will cover my new air cup yes this sheds mm. Mm. See, remember I was telling you guys about the Glam Life lace tint? Mm hmm. And the hand sanitizer, don't forget that you're going to need that to clean your hands first. And in between, and this scalp protector, you apply before you apply your lace. Hi guys, thanks for tuning in. Please don't forget to like, love, and share this video. Also, tune into my facebook business page my instagram my tiktok i got rid of my snapshot i may bring it back out sometime and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel so you can get all the updates whenever i post new video thank you guys bye thank you for all the birthday greetings one more look of my haircut yes did that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you.